fuel off. So uh, I decided to add that little piece of aluminum from the scrap pile. It's got the rubber grip on it. So you turn left to go right, right to go left. Now if I could have reversed that uh, the piece that drags the pitman arm to the other side, it would have been correct. But it gets interfering with the belts and stuff. So I was kind of forced to build the steering that I did. And uh, suggestions of go find and use parts or buying a new lawnmower. I'm not like that. If I can fix it and I can make it, that's, you know, I love the challenge of keeping a 25 year old lawnmower cutting grass, keeping my money in my pocket. I have a total of $20 because it. Everything I used was scrap metal that I had laying around or parts from the existing steering box. It's, it's working. Sunday morning. Took my solar panels down for my solar heater. I'm going to paint the back of my house. Uh, get it all painted up and looking good again. This is that uh, Texture 111. If you don't stay on it. It can get bad on you, so you got to really keep a good coat. I keep that uh, acrylic stain on it. Getting a little mildew behind where the panels were. I'm going to power wash and then give that a good coat. I tried to make this look sort of like a Dutch house at the top. You know how they have it, like, with, but it, that would have been obviously plaster instead of uh, roll roofing. But that roll roofing works real good. I've actually done entire exteriors with that for people down south with the white. See what's going on here in Rusty, Rhode Island. We're getting the garage cleaned out. We're going to bring the uh, 48 in and start working on the uh, headrest. Got the lights working now so I can put the headrest. And I've got these, uh, this horn going to get put on the one that I made and uh, got these visors that came with the truck I'll fix these up paint them orange stick them on I got some new visors these are brand new that I got when I bought the 1966 Chevrolet I might pull those out and see if they're in better shape see so what's going on here in rusty Rhode Island it's uh Sunday, April 21st. 